The Jurassic Park franchise started out with Steven Spielberg's desire to bring the popular Michael Crichton novel to the big screen. What followed was nothing short of a blockbuster phenomenon that swept the world and turned fantasy films on their heads. It was also a springboard for advanced CGI techniques that changed the way movies were made. With a sixth film in the franchise ready to drop, it's time to look back on the installments that came before. Each film introduced moviegoers to a series of new and awe-inspiring dinosaurs. However, let's not kid around. It's the dangerous dinosaurs that everyone loves to watch, and here are 10 of the absolute deadliest that have ever shown up on screen. But before we start, please like, subscribe to the channel and click on the bell. Here we go. Number 10. Compsognathus. At first glance, compies don't look very threatening. In fact, they're slightly adorable in many ways, mostly due to their diminutive size and overall chipper demeanor. Unfortunately, it's a smokescreen for their true intentions. Compies hunt in packs, and although one isn't much of a threat, a heart is capable of taking down very large prey. This was demonstrated with horrific effect in the lost world, when a full-grown man is easily overwhelmed by a pack of relentless compies who tear him apart off-camera. It's a startling example of why one should never underestimate any creature from the Jurassic period. Number 9. Dilophosaurus. Large lizards with sharp teeth should be an immediate red flag to stay away. This includes the Dilophosaurus, a dinosaur slightly larger than a big dog that possesses a few terrifying evolutionary hunting abilities. The full horror of this creature was unleashed in the first Jurassic Park film when one crossed paths with Dennis Nedry. At first, the creature seemed curious, but when it identified Nedry as prey, it flared its hood with aggression and spit venom at his eyes to blind him. Left to its own devices, this poison was also capable of paralyzing prey, allowing the Dilophosaur to devour a warm meal. Number 8. Pteranodon. Jurassic Park 3 first introduced terror from above when it debuted the Pteranodon, a fearsome winged predator of immense size that was capable of grabbing humans like featherweights and carrying them off to be devoured. The survivors of Isla Sorna barely made it out alive after entering their pen. This creature is a flying terror straight out of a child's worst nightmares and not something one would want to cross paths with. It would make a comeback in Jurassic World in the form of the smaller but no less terrifying pterosaurs who descend on the park's unfortunate tourists. Number 7. Carnotaurus. The Carnotaurus resembles a distant cousin of the T-Rex with two horns on its head and even smaller arms. Though it didn't get much screen time, it did show up in Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom during a key scene where it attacks Owen, Claire, and Franklin in the middle of the volcanic eruption. The film version is much larger than the real dinosaur was, but fairly on par with theories regarding its appearance. Though widely regarded as an opportunistic predator, the Carnotaurus may have evolved extremely poor hearing, which would have been a downside in nature. Number 6. Velociraptors. Velociraptors are terror incarnate for so many reasons, including one of the most bone-chilling scenes of the entire franchise. They're large, nimble, and highly intelligent. The cherry on top is a pair of razor-sharp toe claws that can shred prey to ribbons. Raptors usually hunt in packs and are clever enough to use flanking techniques to take down prey. They continue to remain one of the most iconic dinosaurs in the franchise, even if they aren't technically velociraptors. In fact, the creature shown in the films is actually a Deinonychus, but Jurassic Park author Michael Crichton changed its name to sound more threatening and dramatic, much to the chagrin of Dino experts. Number 5. Indoraptor. Like the Indominus Rex that preceded it, the Indoraptor was a byproduct of Jurassic World's geneticists farting around with things better left untouched. The result was a hybridized killing machine bred specifically for use as a biological weapon. Its DNA is comprised of the aforementioned Indominus and a Velociraptor, creating one very deadly mutt. The Indoraptor was developed to hone in on specific targeting technologies and go for the kill. Outside of its parameters, however, it was no less lethal all on its own. It took the most terrifying hunter aspects of the Indominus Rex and blended it with the Raptor's penchant for stealth and problem-solving. It definitely wasn't going to win awards for cinematic scientific accuracy, but it did make for one terrifying baddie. Number 4. Tyrannosaurus Rex. No matter how fearsome the dinosaurs in Jurassic Park world get, there's still no topping the classic T-Rex. 
This iconic dinosaur is the stuff that inspired generations of kids to get into paleontology. And it's hard to argue its cool factor, even among bigger and sleeker peers on the food chain. The T-Rex is terrifying in every way. It's a mechanical killing machine that hunts with specific criteria, making it seem more like a robot than a life form. Its destructive power and voracious appetite are matched only by its intimidation factor. Try as they might, filmmakers won't be able to top it. Number 3. Spinosaurus. The Spinosaurus was introduced in Jurassic Park 3 in an attempt to shake up the established formula while giving audiences something else to scream at besides the aforementioned T-Rex. It's a fearsome dinosaur that looks leaner and meaner than its competitor, and it's even more deadly. The T-Rex might still rule the cool crowd, but the Spinosaurus is a heavyweight all its own. While a T-Rex is capable of killing a Spinosaurus, that's usually not the case. Jurassic Park 3 showed the original Spino snapping the neck of a T-Rex like a twig, which was a shock to audiences who thought the latter was the big kid on the block. Number 2. Mosasaurus. The only reason the Mosasaurus isn't number one on our list is due to the fact that it spends all its time in the water. If this were a land-based creature, it wouldn't be a contest. This is, without a doubt, one of the most fearsome and dangerous dinosaurs the franchise has ever showcased, rivaling even the iconic Jaws for the deep sea killer crown. The sheer size of the Mosasaurus is incredible, and its killer jaws can make mincemeat out of even larger prey. What's truly frightening is the realization that it doesn't actually need to chew, but simply swallow its prey whole. If one of these evolved limbs and made it onto land, it's doubtful humans would be around to tell the tale. Number 1. Indominus Rex. The most dangerous dinosaur on this list is undoubtedly the Indominus Rex. It's an unholy bastardization of genetic manipulation, solely for the purpose of thrilling new patrons and earning their cash. This not only makes it immoral from a natural standpoint, but it's grossly irresponsible at the same time. The Indominus blends DNA from multiple dinosaurs to create what is almost a perfect killing machine. It's large, fast, and extremely strong. It's also borderline insane, with an aggression threshold unseen in other species. It kills on sight for no rhyme or reason and takes great delight in the hunt. It can even camouflage itself within its surroundings to fool, not just the eye, but advanced technologies like thermal sensors. Something this destructive would never occur in nature, all on its own. Well, how do you like the selection? If you want to watch more of these videos, be sure to check out my channel, because there are still a lot of such videos. Subscribe and turn on notifications, so you don't miss the next videos. And also check out this playlist of my top 10 videos, and see you in the next videos. See you soon.